A jaw-dropping scene unfolded on Singapore's East Coast Parkway, something you don't see every day. A Chinese PhD student from Imperial College London, Jason Wen, was caught on camera driving a Shanghai-registered electric vehicle, EV, in Singapore. But here's the catch, he didn't just ship it over. He drove it all the way from China, covering over 3,000 kilometers across multiple countries before finally arriving in the Lion City. And the journey? It was anything but ordinary. This incredible road trip was first captured by a fellow driver and uploaded to Xia Hongshu, sparking massive discussions online. Wen was behind the wheel of a 2023 NEO ES6 electric all-round sport utility vehicle SUV, an advanced EV from China's rising automotive giant NEO. What really caught people's attention? His car still had its Shanghai registration plates as it cruised along Singapore's roads. His online pseudonym, Jason, United Kingdom's nonchalant man Jason, was even displayed on the rear windshield, making it clear, this wasn't just any car, this was a statement. Now, how exactly did he do it? When later confirmed in a Xia Hongshu post at 1 a.m. on February 27 that his journey actually began in Yunnan, China's southwestern province that borders Laos, Vietnam, and Myanmar. From there, he drove through Laos, Thailand, Malaysia, and finally arrived in Singapore. That's a multi-country road trip in an EV, something many people wouldn't even attempt, considering the paperwork, regulations, and charging infrastructure challenges. Speaking of charging, that was a major concern for many who saw his post. When shared images of his SUV being charged in Thailand and Malacca, proving that it's possible to drive an electric vehicle over vast distances, even across different countries. According to NEO, the ES6 SUV can travel up to 930 kilometers on a single charge with a 150 kilowatt hour battery. But was that really enough to make this journey smooth? Many users flooded his comment section with questions. How much did the entire trip cost? How did he manage to charge the car in unfamiliar locations? But the story doesn't stop there. When wasn't the only one who made this trip? Another Xia Hongshu user spotted a black Edo EV, registered in Guangzhou, China, parked at Harbourfront in Singapore on the same day. This second EV was later confirmed to have traveled alongside one, making this an even bigger feat, two Chinese electric vehicles, driving over 3,000 kilometers all the way to Singapore. So, what does this mean for the future of electric vehicles? Could this be proof that long-distance EV road trips across Southeast Asia are becoming viable? And if that's the case, could we see more Chinese electric cars showing up on Singapore's roads in the near future? Let us know what you think in the comments. Would you take an EV on a cross-border road trip, or do you think the challenges still outweigh the benefits? Drop your thoughts below. And before you go, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to 2230 for more incredible stories from around the world. Stay tuned for the next big story because there's always more than meets the eye.